Okay, so this is the Black Tech Geared Head Simulator. Um, I keep it at our studio at Frame Discrete. I'll be renting it out in case you want to use it to practice learning how to use Geared Head. Um, it runs through their software, the Geared Head Simulator. You can use other software as well. This one's what it comes with. So basically it gets you two wheels, two connectors, a box that you can use carry it to set. So if you want to put it on your cart so your crew can practice with it or so you can practice with it on set, um, it's great like that. On here, you've got controls for pan and tilt, so you can reverse the um, pan and tilt if you'd like to from there. Um, inside the software, you've got a football simulator where two guys are running around playing football. Uh, you can zoom in, you can zoom out. It's got the area interface to make it feel like the cameras that you're probably used to using. It tells you what the focal length is on there. You can position the camera, move it to where you'd like it to be anywhere. You can raise it up and raise it down. So it tells you what all the buttons are. R and F goes up and down. Um, the wheels themselves are quite smooth. They did a really nice job with them for getting around. Um, if you want to do a move, you can have preset positions. You can program it in. So if I hit a spot, it's gonna like track me across to wherever that position was set to. And you can also set your own preset positions. Um, you can change the speed of the actors if you want to. You can record your um, your practice training so you can watch it back if you ever needed to. Uh, you can go in and even change like your frame ratios, so your aspect ratios. So depending on what you're shooting at, it gives you more of a feeling of what your camera is actually kind of feeling like. Uh, there's a few other options in here. Uh, I'll jump out of here, try not to make this too long. Also you can adjust uh, different modes as a city race as well. So you can track two cars booting around the city. It's all about just like muscle memory. So this is really good to actually have something to work with, not just like a laser pointer on a geared head at a, at a camera rental house. And this you can take kind of anywhere with you as well. Like you can take it if you're on a location shoot and you want to practice at your hotel room at night, you can do that. Um, if you press the button again, it moves me to a different position. So it does like a jib move to wherever it needs to move to. And you can change the speed of those as well couple of dudes here, so if you want to try and do a move in from those dudes to moving away from them. Uh, and let's change this to slow. There's a move. Here they go. So it tracks you away from them. And you can practice your move there. There's also a butterfly one, which just has two guys just sitting on the ground. Um, they don't really do anything at all. There's a butterfly you can track and follow. Um, but for this one though, I would just practice the preset positions that they have. And um, do, do this really slow. Um, you can go to a different position as it moves and you can practice your move. And so that's, that's what that one's kind of used for. And there's also the labyrinth. So you can move around here and practice following um, the lines as you go around. You can also zoom that in to make it more difficult or more challenging for yourself more, or easier uh, depending on where it is. Um, these are all great ways to kind of just get muscle memory and get used to moving around with the wheels. Um, yeah, it's a great little simulator. Um, like I said, if you want to practice with it, I'll rent it out of the studio here at Frame Discrete. Um, and just look me up, Justin Lovell, Instagram, or wherever. Uh, if you don't have my number already, or just look up Frame Discrete and just contact me through that. Uh, yeah, we're just in the West End, uh, Keel and Dundas area. That's where they keep the, the system here right now. And I'll be letting you take it out for like a week at a time or a couple days at a time, whatever works for you, just to practice. So if you're getting on a show and you just need to just get used to using wheels again, um, it's been really good for me. And it's also been nice to have on set. So when I'm working with my dolly grip, they can actually like practice with the wheels too. So they get a better understanding of what the operator is doing as well as. Um, what they're doing so we all can kind of speak the same language because we're all used, used to using each other's tools um, Yeah, that's it. This is the again the black tech gear head simulator